But we're going to get to the phone lines right now um, because we have the one and only, the man himself, uh, Joseph Parker, on the line right about now, all oh. the way from London. Joseph Parker, good morning. And my lot of us, four, brother, how are you doing, yeah. champ? Hello, hello, how's it going? Hey, good, my brother. How are you feeling, uh, our heavyweight champion, man? How's things, man? Oh, I feel good. You know, I just, listen, I started this morning around 4, 4 o'clock, 4 a.m., and we've just finished now. We just got back to the hotel, so we're just grabbing some dinner. But I feel great. I feel, I'm excited to be heading back to Vegas tomorrow to start training camp, and I'm going to put everything into this camp, and I'm excited for this fight. Yeah, definitely. We are all excited. We've been wanting this fight for a long time. It's been talked about uh, for a very long time as well. The negotiation from Team Park and also uh, Team Joshua trying to put this together. This is probably one of your biggest fights ever, Ma. Also, is it still so surreal that a boy from South Auckland is about to sell out a stadium in Wales? Listen, this, this is going to be the biggest fight of my career. And what can I say? What an incredible journey it's been so far. I'm very blessed to be in this position and this um, to be involved in anything like this, and I represent New Zealand and Samoa. How no, it's, it's crazy to think, like you said, crazy to think a boy from South Auckland, you know, but just doing his best in the boxing world now, being you know, going to help Joshua sell out the stadium. It's going to be an incredible fight, you know. I'm so excited for it. I hope you guys are excited for it as well. Yeah, we are, my also definitely excited about it. And you know what? The whole build-up of the whole thing of boxing, you know, with the whole trash talking, the smack talking, you know, we understand, we get that's just the whole gesture of it. I don't know if that's, uh, for me, myself, also, if that's something that is your game plan. Um, is it really you? Is it like who you are? But do you Listen, regret... It's not, it's not who I am. Yeah, yeah. But do you regret it's not, making it's this... not who I am. Um, there's some comments where I, I feel we have, we've been a bit overboard, but... I'll tell you this: though, if you guys knew what was happening in the background in terms of making the fight happen, mm -hmm. there was, you know, there was there was no noise at all from their team until we started making noise in the media. It must, it might have been overboard, and some of it might have been we shouldn't have said it. But um, no, I spoke to Joshua today. We're we're a face. We're, fa we're doing a thing called um, where we sat down, we spoke to each other across the table, and we, you know, one thing that I know that we have the utmost respect for each other, and uh, he knows he knows that was it wasn't me that was uh, you know, sort of saying those things, and so he knows. The, the real person that I am. But that's what I mean. That's my point proven right there because I was thinking, I don't think it's, I don't think this is Joseph Parker because we know Joseph Parker and he's not like that. But I believe that, you know, what you guys did and you guys had to do what you had to do in order to get under Joshua's skin to actually make this fight happen. Yeah, but so, so we had to sort of do um, a few things and say a few things. But now that the fight's happening, if, now the fight's locked in, it's back to the normal person that I am. Those, those, those things that I've, you know, some of the things that I said and some of the, so the way that I acted, it wasn't really me, and I and I and, if, and I felt uncomfortable doing it. But now mm. that the fight's locked in, um, we've we've uh, we've pieced it out with each other, and we're just we're, we're so excited to get in the ring and, and to beat each other up. That's what that's what <laughs> we're talking about. Um, I gotta say, also it's so great to hear that. But also, what threats does Joshua pose against a fighter like you, Mauso? What threats does he pose? He, well, he's a he's a come forward fighter with a lot of power, and so I have to be on my A game. I have to be sharp. I have to be lighter than I was my, my, in my last in my previous fights I'm going to have to be the best dressed of Parker that's ever uh, that everyone's ever, ever seen Look, you know, also, i got to tell you this, and I'm going to tell you this from the bottom of my heart, man. I believe in you. We believe in you here in New Zealand and Samoa. We all believe in you, my brother, and we've got nothing but love and support, and we wish you nothing but the best, my bro. Hey, thank you very much. You know, like, the support that I get from the New Zealanders and Samoa, and then from everyone back home, that's, that's you know, that's... Um, something that I'll treasure and something that I'll use as a motivation when things do get hard. You know, training camp is not easy, yep. but when, when times do get hard, I'm going to use the motivation of those supporting me, um, my parents, my daughter, and, and all of that to, to help push me through the hard times. Come on now, that's right, man. So we're here, we're all behind you, Mausa, and we can't wait. Uh, also, train hard. We, we got this, you got this, Team Park all the way. And don't forget, also, when you become that superstar, when you knock him out, don't forget where you come from, bro. <laughs> also, I'll, listen, I'll never, forget where, I'll never forget where I come from. And I'll, I, I'm, I'm sure I'll be speaking to you guys before the fight. So um, until then, you guys take care, and thank you for your love and support always. And I look forward to... Showing you guys what I can really do. Yes. Fantastic. Also, yes, I love for Aqua, brother, and keep up the good work, my bro. And yes, we'll definitely catch up before the fight, my man, just to get how you feel well, and I'm, how things are going. I love for Aqua, my Aqua, and hey, listen, I'll talk to you.